Well, the best in heritage uh, has been creating th created uh, 13 years ago uh, after everybody ref refused it. I was forced to uh, go into the realization of it, uh, and uh, I don't feel sorry because uh, it is a different conference which I wanted to create. Different by the fact that it's not really uh, uh, about talking too much or talking much at all, uh, but it's about the best examples of very successful practice. Uh, by this, uh, I mean a process of selection that others did for us. So we are not responsible in the sense for what we show, which is a curious thing to say, but uh, actually we are what French would say, crème de la crème, uh, a sort of a selection of uh, the work that some 50, 60 juries all over the world have done uh, in uh, electing finally filtrating uh, the, the winners of their award schemes. So this year, uh, after 13 years of projects, maybe 220 altogether so far, we have a selection of 24 out of 400 awards that we have spotted all over the world. Uh, well, of course, any selection is arbitrary, but uh, our criteria is the others uh, work uh, like professional juries were the selected. Now, uh, as I uh, am aware that technology would interest you, uh, obviously uh, then there's technological part to anything. I have, I do have problems to uh, say which museum or uh, heritage institution uses technology in the most convincing or effective way uh, and probably doesn't exist uh, uh, as such because there are so many that are doing it very well. Uh, but the rules uh, under, uh, uh, under quotation marks, the rules do exist, and that is uh, the creativity. The more creativity, the better the use. Uh, technologies are uh, by itself a value, value to be used, means, as well as museum itself. Uh, as you know, uh, that could be a, a beautiful collection, but then it's about the curatorial work their creativity that, uh, that are going to turn or not this beautiful collection into usable uh, means. So even museum is means, even collections are means and of course technology is means uh, that you use for the best of it. Uh, when you are creative and you know what to do, when you know for whom you are working and if you are really working for somebody's needs and the people do recognize that, then you may be successful. So technology uh, can be incredibly inspiring, in, in some cases uh, literally showing you the proper way, but you have to understand it. Uh, you don't take it as a technological or technical fact, you understand it and then you use it. Uh, like, as I say, with museums, you understand museums and then if you do understand them, uh, you use them correctly for the benefit of all. Thank you very much. Okay.